Hello, and welcome back to our channel, Screenplay Recaps. It's about an unfaithful husband who has cheated on her spouse for many years, but when the wife takes revenge, the husband gets astounded. So let's get started. We begin with a 50th birthday celebration of Remco. Inika, his wife, presents him with a gift, which turns out to be a schedule book. Remco said, a schedule book in response, Inika says, are you expecting something else? Remco said he was not hopping anything, instead, she doesn't have to throw the party, cause it's not necessary. Inika gets frustrated and asks whether to do the party or not. Remco responded yes. Afterward, a gorgeous girl named Meryl arrives at Remco's residence during the celebration. Leek is taken aback to see her because it isn't Leek's birthday, so she didn't invite her. Anyhow Leek lets her in. While heading upstairs, Leek's brother Tobias encounters Meryl to say hi and take a photo of her, and Tobias has a severe crush on her. After that, Meryl and Leek have their own party, dance to catchy tunes, and enjoy some music. On the other hand, Vim rushes to the bathroom to burn some documents while another person pursues him to stop him. Finally, he broke the lock and entered the toilet, but it was too late. Vim burns the papers because he feels the moment is not suitable to give them to him. After a while, a lovely pregnant lady named Nadia arrives at Remco's residence. Inika investigates her purpose for being here. Ik kom Remco feliciteren. Remco gets astonished to see Nadia at the party because he wasn't expecting her, even though his wife Inika is uncomfortable with Nadia's presence at the party. Nadia hands him a gift. After that, Ramko gave a speech and expressed his gratitude to everyone for attending. Meanwhile, Tobias tags an inappropriate picture of Meryl on the photo wall. Inika quickly pulls the photo from the wall and approaches Tobias, asking whether anything is going on between them. Tobias remains silent. Inika tear apart the picture and advises him Meryl is not the right girl for her son. Vim asks Nadia who the child's father is during the celebration. Nadia claimed to have met him in Japan. It was love at first sight for both of them. Unfortunately, he passed away in a car accident. Oh, is the Japan. Yeah. <laughs> After that, Leek queries Nadia about her current stage of pregnancy. Nadia says, eight months have passed. Then Leek touches Nadia's belly and tells her she can't feel anything, and Nadia runs away horrified. Leek promptly rushes to throw up due to excessive drinking and falls on the floor. Meryl and Tobias rush her to her room and snuggle her into bed. Remco comments after the party that it was a lovely one, to which Inika responds that it is customary for people to grumble before having a good time. Inika also cautions him that their marriage will end if she learns Ramko is the father of Nadia's kid. When Ramko arrived at the office the next morning, he found that the Dubai firm would not continue the project unless the dues were settled. Vim appears out of nowhere and informs him that they will soon go bankrupt as a result of a Dubai project catastrophe. So, they must sell the business if they don't want to declare bankruptcy. A Chinese company has made a very attractive offer to buy their company and they must consider it. Hebben jullie achter mijn rug om zitten dealen? Ramco becomes enraged and he storms out of the room. When he returns to his room, he discovers Nadia is already there. Nadia confesses to him that she lied during the party. Ramco is the biological father of her child. At that point, Vim walks into Ramco's room and threatens to sell the business if he wants Nadia to keep quiet, if not, they will inform his wife. Ramco has no choice except to sell the business. Vim also offered him a 24-hour window to make a choice. Afterward, Tobias visits Meryl at her college and invites her to lunch. Meryl gives the justification that she needs to study for tests the following week. Therefore, she is unable to accompany him. Instead of preparing for exams, she went directly to the hotel to see Ramco. His partners are blackmailing him into selling his company because they have leverage due to Nadia's pregnancy. Meryl then meets Leek at the restaurant. Leek notifies Meryl that Nadia is pretending to be pregnant. First and foremost, she felt nothing when she touched her tummy. Second, when puking, she discovered the sanitary pad in the toilet because Nadia was the last one to use it. Meryl's phone rings as she walks to the restroom. Leek receives it and learns that her father is having an affair with her best friend. Leek gets enraged and yells at her loudly. She rushes out of the restaurant right away. Meryl was stunned and speechless. That evening, during dinner, 
Ramco announces that he will sell the firm because a Chinese corporation offered him an incredible offer that he cannot reject. However, Inaka finds it strange and opposes selling the company because she has an equal stake. Meanwhile, Tobias receives a call from Merrill, who requests that he come over to pick her up as soon as possible. He picked her up and devised a scheme to spy on Nadia. Hey, did he fly by? They then proceed to Nadia's house to perform a Sherlock Holmes-style investigation. A commotion happened at the wrong time. It turns out Nadia arrives home and the jackpot hits. The mistrust leak had of Nadia was entirely justified, it is very obvious that she is fabricating her pregnancy. The following day, Ramco bids Inika farewell and prepares to go to the office to complete the transaction. Tobias and Merrill head toward the house as Ramco departs. Tobias heads straight upstairs to share their Sherlock Holmes adventure with Leek, while Merrill heads to see Inika. Merrill claims she has something to tell her. Inika replies that she already knows about her affair with Ramco. Merrill gets stunned. Inika further state that you are not alone. She has seen far too many of her husband's girlfriends. She accepted that side of her husband quite a long ago. Ramco was the same before and after his marriage. He gets close to them and then dumps them. However, Najda's pregnancy has completely altered the scenario. Merrill claims that is why she came here to talk to her. Nadia is forging her pregnancy drama. Inika hastily packed her belongings, tossed the scissor in the bag, and headed to the office. At the same time, Merrill makes her way upstairs to visit her dearest pal. Merrill did excellent detective work in solving this traumatic puzzle. Therefore, Leek is no longer mad at her. When Inika arrives at the office, she goes straight to the boardroom. Fortunately, the meeting has not yet begun due to the Chinese business group being late at the office. When Remco is about to sign the paperwork, Inika interrupts the meeting enters the room and sits beside Nadia. Inika abruptly pulls out the scissors and stabs Nadia's fictitious tummy many times. The fake belly is subsequently seen with astonishment by everyone. Nadia and Vim are dumbfounded at the same time. Remco, you come to self Finally, Inika arrives just in time to save the firm from this swindle. Instead of pressing charges, Ramco presents another option. If Fred joins Ramco, they will be able to fire fraudster Vim with majority shareholder authority. Ramco receives immediate approval from Fred. Ramco then met with the Chinese business delegation and recommended a merger approach rather than selling his entire firm to them. Ramco then rushes to the hotel to meet Merrill and enthusiastically recounts the whole story to her and ends their relationship the same way he ditches all his girlfriends. Remco then pours the drink into the glass and calls another girl to meet him tonight. Tobias and Leek are waiting for Meryl when she comes down. It's like Tobias's fantasy has come true. We discovered Ramco didn't contact any of his girlfriends that night at the restaurant, instead, he called his wife. Remco is curious to know how Inika knows about Nadia's fake pregnancy saga. Inika responds that your ex-girlfriend Meryl helps salvage the firm and that he owes her gratitude. Inika further states that she is pregnant and plans to inform him on his birthday. However, because of Nadia's drama, she could not inform him. Ramco gets overwhelmingly excited to hear that. Nonetheless, Inika ruins Ramco's happiness by revealing he is not the father of this child. So that was tricked. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, and turn on the notification so you won't miss the next recap. Until then, cheers!